Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Pulsefix, and uh, here we had a mixed federation battle for you guys, and this is against Cat Fighter Force 9. I hope you all enjoy, and um, I hope everyone had a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year to come. 2010 going to be a pretty awesome year, hopefully. All right, so um, anyways, uh, here we go. I lead off with a Prime AP, leads off with a Sand Slash. I go for the U-turn just to see what he's going to do. He does stay in and goes for Stealth Rocks. So I'm going to switch into my uh, Blastoise predicting the stealth rocks and stuff, which is obvious. And um, then I'm just going to go for a Toxic predicting to switch into a Ghost because the Rapid Span is a little obvious. But he switches into this uh, Registeel. So I'm just going to take this chance to U-turn just to blow the rocks away. And he's going to go for Iron Defense. I'm going to switch into my uh, Latios thinking this is Revolution X1600 set because I do see the Toxic on this thing. So I'm going to trick it as specs, hoping I lock it into Amnesia, but he goes for Seismic Toss, so I can see now that this is in Revolution set, so yeah, alright. Um, so I'm going to uh, just go for Surf here, just to get as much damage on this thing as possible. If he switches out, then um, it's really whatever, so yeah. Um, so I'm going to go for Surf here, just to see what he switches into, or possibly stays in with. Um... I uh, hit him with the Surf on this uh, Dusnor, which does a pretty decent chunk to him. And um, I'm thinking I could possibly 2 a KO this thing with Draco Meteor at this point. So I'm going to Draco Meteor. It does a really big chunk to him. I'm hoping that I can kill it off with another Draco Meteor. Um, and um, he goes for a will of predicting a switch. So I don't know. I don't even know what he's doing. <laughs> Um, he's kind of over-predicting here, but it's whatever. All right, so I'm going to Draco Meteor, and um, that's going to... Not take out the Dust Noir, which is unfortunate for me, and he's able to take out my Latios. So, that's really whatever. Alright, so now I'm going to switch into my Prime Ape here. I'm going to go for the U-Turn, just to kill off this uh, um, Dust Noir, because I know it'll kill it off, obviously, at that low of health. And um, I'm just going to switch into my Blastoise, just to see what he switches into. He switches back into this Registeel. I'm going to go for the Protect, just to scout out what he's going to do. He's going to go for the Toxic, and um, I'm just going to switch into something that can um, take the Toxic for me. Alright, so um, now I'm going to switch into Primeape. Um, in case he switches out, knowing that I know he's locked into Toxic, but he just stays in and goes for to Toxic. And then now my uh, Primeape is Poison, which is unfortunate, but um, not that big of a deal. So um, now I'm just going to U-turn, because I know he'll definitely switch out here, because um, nobody wants to be locked into Toxic. And um, he's going to switch into Sand Slash, I guess predicting the physical move, maybe. I'm not even sure. But I go for U-turn, I hit it off on this... Uh, Sand Slash, which is awesome. Alright, so now I'm going to go for a uh, Rock Polish on um, Relicanth, and um, he's going to go for a Super Fang. I probably just should have went for the uh, Waterfall, which probably would have killed, um, but it's not that big of a deal. I go for the Waterfall, hoping it does kill. Unfortunate for me, he lives with like 1 or 2 HP, so he's able to knock off my Life Orb, which really sucks, because um, I wanted to uh, get this match done earlier than possible, but it's whatever. Alright, so um, now he's going to switch into this uh, uh, Machamp. I really forgot that rock, uh, that fighting resist rock type moves, so that's unfortunate for me. And he kills off my um, uh, Relicant with a dynamic punch, but it's really whatever. Alright, so now I'm going to switch into my Blastoise now, because it's my best bet to take uh, dynamic punches. And um, I'm just going to go for a Surf here. Predicting a switch back into Registeel, thinking he'll probably predict my uh, Toxic, so I'm going to Surf. I hit this Alakazam, and um, he did actually predict the Toxic, and he wanted to Psychronize it onto my Alakazam, so it's a good thing I didn't go for the Protect, I mean, um, Toxic, because uh, that uh, Machamp is a pretty big threat um, to my team. So yeah, I'm going to Protect here, just to scout what he's going to lock himself into, because I know this thing is probably Specs, because almost all of them are. So um, I'm going to switch out now into my... Um, Snorlax, he's going to go for Psychic. I know Snorlax can pretty much take it uh, pretty well, but unfortunate for me, he gets a special defense drop, which sucks, so I'm not going to be able to uh, set up with a Snorlax, so that's unfortunate for me. Alright, so I'm going to go for a Body Slam here. He's going to go for the Psychic, and um, I hit the Alakazam, which is awesome, and that's going to kill the um, Alakazam, so that's cool. Alright, so um, now he's going to switch back into his uh, Machamp. And um, I'm going to switch back into my um, uh, Blastoise just to take the dynamic punches. But he ends up going for the bulk up. So I'm hoping that I can 
take uh, some dynamic punch from this thing. He goes for dynamic punch, which is going to do a little bit well at the halfway point, and um, with leftovers, I'm going to be able to survive at least three of them, hoping that I don't get confusion axe. But um, I'm not going to take the chance to use a uh, protect here, and um, I know dynamic punch will hit through protect though, so I'm going to switch into Snorlax now just to take the dynamic punch, and um, that's a good play on my part, I guess. And um, he's going to get some more toxic damage, so yeah. And um, now I'm going to switch back into my Blastoise. I'm just going to go for Surf here. And um, that is going to, to uh, bring him down to pretty low health. I'm hoping that a Toxic can um, wear him down enough to where I can kill him off of Blastoise one last time. Um, which it does, which is awesome. I'm hoping I hit through the Confusion. I do, and that my champ goes down, and that is a pretty big threat for, to my team off... Um, well, the, uh, it's a pretty big threat to my team. Is dead now, so that's cool. All right, so now I'm gonna go for surf on this uh, red steel because um, I don't think I'll survive a seismic toss, and I really have no reason to keep uh, Blastoise in at that low health. So I'm just gonna leave him in his death fall to go for surf. It doesn't take too much out of him. I'm just gonna switch to my primate now since Blastoise is dead. I'm gonna go for uh, um, close combat just to, to a KO this thing. <clears throat> He's gonna keep seismic tossing. Uh, the poison's wearing me down pretty bad. I'm just gonna keep close combating because, well, it's the best move I can do. Obviously, I don't want to switch out here, which would be stupid. And um, now he's gonna switch back into his um, uh, Gastrodon, which is his last Pokemon. So I'm gonna go for close combat. I get a crit and win. So um, I don't know if that mattered too much because um, my last Pokemon was Raikou, which was Spec. So I don't know if it mattered too much if. It would have changed the game, but oh well. It happens sometimes. So, good game. Raycom, subscribe, folks. Um, check out my channel. Check out the Federation. And I hope to see you all next time. Peace, guys. Bye.